everybody uh, this is just a quick video it's more of a tester video because uh, I got a new microphone for this I don't know if you noticed but my voice doesn't exactly carry or I yeah it just doesn't go well uh, I I'm planning my fall and winter collection uh, collection sewing project collection and everything uh, I know uh, several things I want to do I can't remember their names now I'll just impose them here uh, I know I want to make a trench coat like I, I really want to make an olive green trench coat I have no idea why olive green I'm just a little obsessed with it so I really want to make an olive green trench coat I uh, there's a couple dresses that I want to make I definitely want to uh, definitely want to make this McCall um, pattern dress it's a sweatshirt dress I definitely want to make that um, I have to find I probably have to buy the pattern online next time there's an online sale because I can't seem to find it in the stores in my size and everything and unfortunately I heard that it runs strangely fitted um, compared to what it looks like so I want to make sure I get I, I probably have to have to cut the biggest size so I want to make sure I get the right size uh, there are a few dresses that I want to make as well. I'm trying to uh, really figure out my color scheme. Like, I need to, I want to be able to mix and match all of these. Uh, I want to make my first blouse and bodysuit. And there are two, um, patterns I want to use for that. They're both McCall, I believe. Yeah, one is for a jumpsuit. That's this. And the other is a, it's like a bra and panty set with a robe. I've made the bra, it's a halter bra. You could totally like make that bra into a swimsuit. I don't see myself wearing it as a bra. I made it as out of chambray um, just to make it. And with a couple adjustments, I would definitely make it into a swimsuit top before the end of summer, hopefully. Uh, but there's an underwear piece to it I thought since the waistband at the bottom of the sh the top part of the jumpsuit is already elasticated I thought it'd be really easy just to add the underwear on it to make a bodysuit I think it would look really cute um, I have a couple fabric choices in mind um, some I already have some um, or maybe if I find something I think I have something I already have that I want to try out and uh i'm i've been having so much trouble with pants like i really want to make a pair of pants but every time i try with white leg pants i hate it like i have no problem constructing it it's just getting the size right the look right and i think i just end up hating the way i look in pants like whether i make them or not so i'm debating on whether i want to try another pair of pants if I find something and find a bunch of tips on it, maybe I'll try. But otherwise, I might steer away from pants a little bit. Um, I definitely have a couple. Uh, there's a definitely this blouse and a um, shirt that are in the same pattern. The simplicity pattern is right here. Uh, it's a sheared, like elasticated sheared looking neckline and wristbands. Uh, I saw two um, shirts that I really loved. Uh, one was on Tracy Ellis Ross. It was black and um, see-through, and the neckband was the same. And one was uh, one of the twins on Q2, um, Q2 Han, Yan, Han. I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong. I'm sure you know who they are. They're um, popular on YouTube. Um... I don't know if I can, I'll, I'll try to find that picture of her in it. Hers was pretty much the same as the one of Tracy Ellis Ross, except it was white and sheer with white polka dots all over it. And her, the wristband, the sheared part of the wristband was much longer. I think I want to go that route as well. Uh, I just thought it was really pretty. I need to find the right sheer. It's, I strangely can't find the right sheer fabric. I probably just um, go to Joann's with that in mind once I get my whole color scheme um uh, figure it out I don't want to I know it's fall and winter but I wear so many dark colors blacks and blues and grays I'm trying to do fall with some color I'm figuring that out what I want what will work out what I know I'll wear a few times uh, and that's basically my 
general plans right now. And I'll keep you guys posted. And Chelsea's doing this as well. Um, my sister Chelsea, I'm sorry. I'm saying this like you guys even know who this is. Chelsea is my youngest sister who has been sewing for like 10 years. Uh, and I just started sewing a little over a year ago. She's been helping me greatly. And she just started, like she never really did wardrobe stuff in the, unless it was for me and I asked her. Um, so now she wants to like conquer and make her own fall winter wardrobe. So that's what we're both planning right now and hopefully it all works out once we um, she actually just ordered this pink fabric for because she also wants to make a trench coat for the fall she wants this pink trench coat this fabric from fabric.com this is the first time it's only the second time i'm ordering from fabric.com and um, the first time we're ordering this particular fabric so hopefully when it, we just ordered it today so hopefully when it gets here it it works for what we're trying to do and it's a, a nice fabric and everything i see a lot of things i want from fabric.com i'm just i really prefer to touch and feel the fabrics when i buy it that's why i buy it in store from like joann's um because there's plenty of fabrics i even see like walking down the aisle at joann's i'm like oh and then as soon as i touch it i'm like that's not what i expected so i'm kind of you know crossing my fingers about this one <laughs> yeah so that's basically it what we're doing I actually have to go upstairs right now and study for this test I have tomorrow that I have yet to study for so wish me luck intermediate financial accounting guys yeah so have a great day and happy sewing we'll see you soon bye mm -hmm.